This video is dedicated to Bad Bulldozer Bambino Piedone Spencer in loving memory. Hello there everyone, I'm Clown Nebula and I welcome you to Slaps and Beans, a game based upon the characters portrayed by these two immense actors of my country, Italy, but Spencer and Terence Hill. My inner fanboy is actually screaming and crying at the same time. I, I love so much their movies, they mean so much to me. They are very fond uh, memory of mine and I still keep uh, uh, watching them. And so, without further ado, let's delve into this fan-made game. Unfortunately, I can't uh, let you see uh, here the, the music because it's copyrighted, but uh, I will put something uh, cool instead. So this guy said, uh, a guy wants to sleep with my man, woman. Enough! Sure! <laughs> Alright, it's time to kick his ass because, uh, yeah, Gringo wanted to sleep with my wife, senor. We're gonna have kick the shit out of him. Alright, uh, of course I will be playing as Bud Spencer. In this uh, uh, particular movie, they called him Trinity. He's called Bambino. And uh, this guy, Terence Seal, is uh, his brother. They say that was a, a son of old slut. <laughs> yeah, they say that. How are we gonna to settle this, boys? All right, it's time to kick some ass. I have to start saying that uh, this game is already starting uh, being totally inaccurate since uh, Bud Spencer has a health bar and is clearly mortal in his films. So yeah, that's uh, very inaccurate of them. Uh, what do you say? Okay, he's another guy. I'm sorry, but I couldn't let him call the old mom old. Uh, <laughs> slot, but it's true. Yeah, but she's not old. Yeah, this was one of the best lines of the movies So I, I can admit that they were not great movies from a objective point of view But I love them so much because they, they were genuine. I mean they were simple, but uh, good laughs good beats When the lady hits you it will hurt less with a little whiskey in your gut All right, and it's also time to drink uh, Whiskey and eat sausages. Another reference to another famous movie of them. So yeah, I love so much the movies. I have uh, quite almost all of them actually. I think I have seen all of uh, theirs. Especially Bud Spencer is my favorite character, of course. And I just beat the shit out of him. Also, another total inaccuracy in this game is that uh, uh, most of the times uh, after Bud Spencer give you a punch or a slap, uh, you're pretty much staying on the ground. All right, it's time to kick their ass. Not kick their ass of uh, Trinita, even though they hate each other. Where are you going? Take a look around. Yeah, it's a quiet day today. See that it ends in the way it started. Because in this movie, Bud is like the uh, marshal of the town, even though he's a criminal. And so it's time to beat everyone out of the building. Like the good old days. Oh, yeah. There we go. Everyone is everybody do the flop. Boom. As you can see, you can pick bodies. This is another feature of bodies. Since he's super strong, is the strong, not so smart guy uh, of the couple. Uh, instead, uh, Tennessee is like quite like the sleek, smart one. All right, and no one can bring Bud Spencer down. As you can see, he has the signature move of the hammer. Uh, Okay, get out of my beans! I want to eat beans! Alright! So I can also have weapons in this game. This is so awesome! Okay, I can also throw them out. Alright, hello ladies! Uh, how are you doing? That, what, there's a DeLorean in there. Is uh, the guy from Back to the Future here? Okay. It's time. Three heads split uh, like melons. So, one, what? Well, you asked me to give you a hand. Not like that debris. You haven't seen what? Two frightened ta phones. There were probably two slots looking for customers. Oh, okay. You son of a. You won't have the lady of the guy, you know? This is the evil guy. Uh, I quite remember this game. Okay. Oh, shit. Uh, I think I need to pick it up. Uh, maybe in a moment where it's not exploding, actually. Shit. Not even dynamite. Oh, I, I got to press T to recover. Shit. No, I can't die, but Spencer cannot die! There we go. Boom, shakalaka. Okay, I have to improve my aim. Shit. You know, he's the only guy who can survive uh, uh, <laughs> a dynamite right at his skin. 
Why are you really missing, man? You had, you had such a good aim. Okay, because I have to time it too. Okay. I see how this is going. Bud Spencer is quite like the Chuck Norris of Italy. Okay. Shit. So, he's the guy that can never be defeated. Alright, to be continued. So, yeah, that was quite short. So, yeah, guys, hope you enjoyed this game. I'm gonna play another one, but uh, yeah, this is very special to me. It's a very cool concept, and I like the idea of uh, bringing these two awesome characters of our cinema history also. They put a major uh, push to the spaghetti western genre and also, you know, the good old simple <laughs> movies of the past. So, yeah, it's, uh, they have a very special place in my heart. And uh, yeah, but wherever you are, we will eat beans one day together. So guys, uh, let's uh, go to the other game. I recommend you to also watch their movies. Uh, and yeah, see you in a bit. And so here we are, playing uh, Tribal and Error. This should be a very interesting game, since we are playing as a robot, trying to understand the language of the cavemen back in uh, prehistory, I'd say. Maybe we are gonna uh, make and learn some stuff too? I don't know, but uh, it's a very awesome concept, uh, made by Grotman. How, how accurate, how appropriate. The graphics is very, very cool. Are very, very cool. This is a snowman with abs. <laughs> oh yeah, because they were so badass. Yeah. <gasps> fire! Man created fire! Okay, this is not quite a cave. Okay, this is the robot as we are playing as. And this is programmed in order to record whatever language they have, so we can bring it back to the future, perhaps? Maybe? Oh, hey! Alright. So we're going to a long time ago before Christ. Oh yeah, so we start our journey. Actually, maybe I should have borrowed the DeLorean uh, of the previous game. Still, this is very, very cool. Alright. Okay, we can move uh, with a standard point and click game. Oh, hey there, first cave man. How you doing? Good to see you here. Hello. Rungu. Rungu. I think this means cold. It's kind of. Star of course, uh, his mucus is freezing. <laughs> Okay, I think uh, I think uh, it means it's cold, actually. Probably. Okay, these are the signs on the wall, so maybe we will be able to understand them uh, soon enough. This is a N rock. Okay. Hello, people. Oh, you want to make fire? Perhaps I can help you somehow. Truck. Truck. up. I can do this. I was rock. Go. Go. Oh go! Hit the rock! Oh go! Oh go! Rooker! This is the family. Okay, they all look the same. I wonder was the woman. <laughs> if they. Or maybe they stole his family. Okay. Maybe this is sadness. Perhaps this means uh, sad. Oh, poor guy, don't worry. You lost your family. Well, it's a pretty common thing since all the perils that they were in there. <laughs> Puko! You say? Puka! Puko! Puko! Okay, I think this means hit, perhaps, or punch. Okay, and this? Rock. Rock. <laughs> uh, okay. Rock. Do rock. Stick. Okay, or wood. Go. Go. Okay, thank you for. I, they're accepting pretty well, this guy, actually. Okay, this... Jago! Jago! Kagut! Kaluk! Rock. Okay, this is rock. Brow! What's brow? What's a brow? Brow! <laughs> This is the, the cry of the wolf. Row. Row. 
like come here. Uh, okay, they accept me as one of them. They actually they are so dumb. <laughs> okay. Okay, rock. Uh, what this? What is? Okay, let's try to say these words. Perhaps this is the way to actually unlock fire. Okay, now this was. Kalu. Okay, this was this one. Okay. Okay. You got it? No. Oh, there we go. Yeah, yeah. Okay, maybe come here. Come here. Oh, I summon you to here. Okay, so this is the formula in order to make fire. Okay. Why did they paint that? Uh, even though maybe they can't read it, uh, perhaps. That's very inconvenient. Okay. Let's see if this works. Good. Okay, there we go. You understood? Yeah! Alright! And fire was made. Cool! Oh, I'm actually teaching them how to make fire. This is the step of evolution that they needed, actually. Okay, this is so lovely. Oh, they need to free her. Okay, so do it again. No, no. No, no. What is this? I love woman. I want that woman there. What does that mean? What does that mean? No, no. Oh, hunger. Huh, oh, food, perhaps. Food. Uh, do you want to eat uh, the woman? I think she's the only one. Man, you can't eat her. Okay, so it was wood plus rock. Yeah, do this so uh, uh, we can free her. And, man, you can't hit her, okay? Run, run. Food. Okay, we're going for food now. Hmm, okay, this is so cool. I didn't understand all their language, though. But this is an awesome concept. Oh, it's time for the hunt. <laughs> Tribal and error. Well, that was fun. Well, thank you for playing it. Thank you for making the game. These are the people that made this. It's really, really interesting. It's a... A kind of unique uh, way of doing puzzle, uh, point-and-click puzzle games. It was very nice trying to understand what they were saying and trying to solve all their problems. It was very nice. Uh, so guys, I hope you enjoyed these two lovely games. I'll put a link in the description down below so you can check them out and play them if you enjoyed. And yeah, I thank very much developers for making these. And I really wish you best of luck uh, uh, for completing them and making them full releases. Especially <laughs> the Bud Spencer game. And sorry, Tribal Error, guys. It's not, uh, I mean, bad for you, but I that game, it's really, really means uh, something to me. So, yeah, I thank you very much for watching. Feel free to comment, like, and subscribe. And let me know in the comments what you think of this game. Feel free to suggest me some games I should play for you. And also remember to share and like the video if you enjoyed. And we will see each other again in the next video I will make. And remember, if you can't sleep... Uh, Oh, caveman, gonna make fire, don't eat the lady though. Good night.